Tuesday night means Evo Stick Northern Premier League action is back in Kirkland's the venue for tonight's game in Division 1 North between Camelards and New Mills. Camelards opening day fixture was away to Lancaster City at the Giant Act Stadium on Saturday gone. A 1-0 defeat there adds pressure on the Camels to get some points on the board at home tonight as they entertain New Mills. The Millers, like Camel Laird, suffered playoff heartache last season, losing to Trafford in the semi-final stage. Under the guidance of Ray Sewell, though, they'll be tough opponents this evening, having won their opening game at home to Bursco by four goals to two. Tonight's team sees Tony Sullivan make two changes to the team that lost to Lancaster on Saturday. Out goes Liam Hullard through a suspension that has come to light just today. Stephen Ferrigan plays instead. Paul Parle is rested from Saturday and Jack Webb comes in in place of him. For New Mills, it's a case of if it's not broke, don't fix it. And Sewell names an unchanged side to the one who were victorious on Saturday against Bursco. The Camelard tonight is all about bouncing back from Saturday's defeat to Lancaster. Getting some points on the board and hopefully try and get themselves in the playoff positions come what may. It will be a long and difficult task. Sides like Darlington and Northwich Victoria and the likes who both started with a win on Saturday. The referee gets us underway. New Mills in the golden black, attacking the goal to our right. And the Laird sporting their brand new kit tonight for the first time, a traditional all blue. And straight away there's an early chance here, and it's dealt with by Sean Roscoe out for a throw in for Camel Lairds. Some support from a former player and now the reserve team manager Carl Clampett, whose side had a decent start with a draw and a win from their opening two fixtures. Chris Riley with the throw. Couch to Riley, first time ball forward for Kearns. It's a couch, slightly overcooked. Made by Danny Shaw. High and over the halfway line. Grogan is underneath the ball. Grogan heads it back to his goalkeeper, Kevin Atherton, very alert and sharp there. You know, there's a bit of pressure of late. Some poor performances, certainly by his standard anyway, and Sullivan has been quick to move and Obtain the services of Andrew Mills from Macclesfield on low. There's a chance here at the other end, and Sean Breen, the flags up, won't count anyway. It's wide of Collins' left hand post. I think he had it covered anyway. Good take from Sean Breen. Good strike. Collins had it well covered. Nevertheless, this is lively from the Camels. Here's Shea Dysart. Over the halfway line, looking for Breen. Here is Sean Green, the new signing, making his home debut for Camel Lairds tonight. Finds Danny O'Brien. Danny O'Brien. Webb. Out for Riley. Good football, this. Riley's crossing towards Couch, who stayed forward. Cleared by Shaw. Now here's Metcalf, is it? Meekin, rather. Carlos Meekin. Rother on his outside, if you can find him. Here is Rother. Goes by Shea Dysart. And a good early cross across the face of goal. Metcalf, good save from Kevin Atherton. But he should have scored and gave the Millers the lead there. Excellent work from Rother. Good early ball across the face of goal. And anywhere but at Kevin Atherton and that was a goal. Great save nonetheless. He held it too. Here's Chris Riley. Over the halfway line. Time and space to run into. Finds Jack Webb. Webb with the crossfield ball looking for Dysart. Dice out the skipper, finds O'Brien, he's the control. Ball forward, given away. Chance again for New Mills to come forward. Given away again by New Mills, and here's Stephen Farragut. Nick Rogan. Lovely ball into the path of Craig Cairns. Craig Cairns will try and shoot. He's blocked off and he gets a corner. Good tackle from Parker. The big men are up from the back, Mike Rogan. 14 goals last season. Cairns is lurking as well. And it will be delivered by Nick Rogan. Had his one by Mike Rogan and Craig Cairns is first to react. And Craig Cairns has given Camelards the lead and their season is off and running. Laird's first goal of the campaign and it's homegrown Craig Cairns. A product of the reserves has fired Laird's in front. Nick Rogan with the corner in. Mike Rogan with the header forward. And Craig Cairns reacted well as the static New Mills defence watched on as the ball ended up in Collinger's net. Camel Laird's lead by a goal to nil. 
Here's Sean Breen. Feeds it to Kearns. Kearns back toward Breen. Headed away by Parker. Bagley to Roscoe. It's something on the ball. Looks like he was caught by Kearns. Here's Rogan. Loses out to Rotha. Here's Meakin. A good header there from Stephen Farragut because there was danger of that ball found its way through. He knows come back. Here's Bagley. Knight who's crossed out to John Couch. Here's Craig Cairns and Sean Breen will be onside when this ball's played forward. Here's Sean Breen round the goalkeeper. 2 0 Camel Lairds. First ever goal for Camel Lairds for Sean Breen. Controversy. There's a man down on the far side, but cool as you like, Sean Breen round the goalkeeper. New Mills have complained they had a man down, but they played on for what was at least 25 seconds by my counting. Camel Lairds have punished the Millers here. 2 0 they lead. Brogan is forward for the free kick, which will be delivered by Chris Riley and towards Grogan beaten in the air by Danny Shaw helped on its way by Bagley here's Carlos Meakin Meakin finds Metcalf Metcalf on the left hand side back for Knight Metcalf again and given away again to Sean Breen and Sean Breen has a chance to run at Parker here Breen with a shot comfortable for Collins and quickly bowls the ball out to the right hand side for Poxon Again, possession is given away and out into touch. We see Green again. Buoyed from his earlier strike. Running it sure and getting his shot away. Throw in to New Mills, which Sean Roscoe will take. Towards Metcalf. And by Parker. Time whistle blows at Kirkland's. A great half of football for Camel Laird. They took the lead through Cairns in the 10th minute. Two minutes later, Breen doubled the lead. Half time at Kirkland's. Camel Laird 2, New Mills 0. Peter Collins. And to Jack Poxon, the right back. Poxon comes inside. Dallion on the ball. Finds Bagley. Bagley with a good cross field ball looking for Scott Metcalf. Here is Scott Metcalf, ball across the face of goal and well held by Kevin Atherton. Under pressure as well. He's had a good game so far. Pulls the ball out to Chris Riley. The ball looking towards Green, but it may fall for Craig Cairns who shoots. Another shot Craig Cairns will want to remember. We see the chance at the other end a moment ago. Scott Metcalf turning Chris Riley inside out. Good low ball across the six yard box. But Kevin Atherton was out to it. And then the shot from Craig Cairns. She pulled wide of the target. Ambitious effort. Kevin Atherton, a long clearance up the field, it's caught by Knight and again by Ferrigan for Camel Lairds and Craig Cairns has been fouled there has he? Danny Shaw protesting his innocence, the referee having none of it, Craig Cairns, pace again, causing teams problems, free kick for Camel Lairds in a very dangerous situation here, Danny O'Brien is over it. Mike Grogan is making his way up from the back. They do pose a threat from set pieces when you've got a deliverer like Danny O'Brien. Danny O'Brien's ball in. Sean Breen's header, 3-0. And that should just about wrap up the points for Camel Lairds. Eight minutes gone in the second half and Sean Breen has got his second goal. Lovely ball from Danny O'Brien. Sean Breen got ahead of his marker. And headed the ball into the corner. Skipper Martin Parker not happy. Peter Collins not happy. Substitution being made. 
Michael Fish coming on to replace Sean Roscoe. Tony Sullivan still shouting words of encouragement. Cameron Laird's three. New Mills nil. Very disappointing night for the side from Derbyshire. Forward by Cairns. Had a forward by Grogan. It's Jack Webb. Slightly miscued pass, but it finds its way out to Nick Rogan. Rogan plays the ball forward. It's intercepted by Michael Fish. And now Chris Riley can come forward for Camel Lairds. Chris Riley looks up, looks towards the back post. Here's John Couch with a chance. Good save from Peter Collins. Pushed out for a corner kick. Corner delivered by Nick Rogan. There's a chance here, is it for Michael Grogan? Camel Lairds could have been 4 0 up. Acrobatic effort from Michael Grogan. Ball was punched up by the goalkeeper. Michael Grogan just couldn't get over the ball. And the Laird's pressure is relentless from the start of the second half. Hugh Mills just looking for a way back into the game. This man has been alert. Anything that's come his way. Old ball flicked on by Cairns. Here's Sean Breen. Green plays it across the face of goal. There's a chance here for Jack Webb over the crossbar. Another one of the summer signings, Jack Webb. Combining with Sean Breen. Why not? Launched upfield by Collins, missed by Grogan. Berrigan with something on there and back by Dysart to Kevin Atherton. Over the halfway line, no one has confusion here at the back. Danny Shaw gives away a corner. Goalkeeper Peter Collins was coming and Danny Shaw maybe didn't hear the shout. Headed it past his own goalkeeper, lucky for him. The one there to capitalise. They do have a corner kick though, Camelaids. Swung in by Nick Rogan. Headed by look like Grogan. And John Couch has gone down there under the challenge from Danny Shaw. The linesman is flagging. And the referee is awarded the penalty. Much to the dismay of the New Mills. Well, looking at the replay again. John Couch was always going to get to the ball first. Danny Shaw takes a chance when he sticks his leg out. A penalty kick, and a chance for Sean Breen to get a hat-trick on his home debut for Camel Laird here at Kirklands. Sean Breen against Peter Collins, and it's 4-0 to Camel Lairds. And if the points weren't secure a few moments ago, they certainly are now. Comprehensive performance this from Camel Lairds. New Mills have Cause Camel Laird's problems. The scoreline may be a little bit flattering at times, but corner will be delivered by Nick Rogan. There's a chance here is the for Mike Rogan again with an acrobatic effort. And this time Danny Shaw makes amends. Controlled it with the head first, Mike Rogan. Then he went for the bicycle kick. And Danny Shaw was alert on the line to clear it away. Corner comes in again from Nick Rogan. Bobbling about. John Couch with a sharp deflection. May fall for Craig Cairns. Cairns 5 0. It's a rout. And Craig Cairns has grabbed himself a second goal tonight. John Couch with a ferocious strike. Come off Melford Knight. And then Craig Cairns again. Cool as you like the finishing tonight. Smash the ball past Peter Collins. And for New Mills, it certainly is going to be a long drive back to Derbyshire from Rock Ferry tonight. Down under the challenge of Breen. Free kick to New Mills. Yeah, 
has come forward again. Danny Grimshaw. Grimshaw and Metcalf combining. Jamie Rother. It's a chance now for Carlos Meekin. Good strike. It's at the post. Carlos Meekin, he's been a good player this evening. Good left footed strike. Kick taken by Kevin Atherton. Sure with the header. It's Jamie Rother. The ball out to the right hand side for Daniel Grimshaw. Grimshaw's got pace. Gets the cross in, does he? No, it's blocked by Dysart. Great tackle from the skipper. Knocked out by John Couch as well. Had to time it well, but that was a penalty. Corner kick to New Mills. Swung in left footed. All the way through to Scott Metcalf on the volley. Would have been spectacular had that had gone in. Corner over the top of everyone. Scott Metcalf on the right foot. Predominantly a left footed player. Remains 5 0. Back to his goalkeeper Collins. Allowed to. Michael Fish, the full-back, substitutes. We'll have to hurry here with John Couch. Gets himself in a bit of a tangle with John Couch. And the referee says that's a foul. And Mills take the free kick quickly. Here's Melford Knight. Fish. Up to Martin Parker. Ben Short. Lovely ball. He's found Daniel Grimshaw. Grimshaw the substitutes cross, cleared by Michael Grogan. Chance again for Metcalf to keep the ball alive for New Mills. Metcalf goes for the shot, it's blocked by Michael Grogan. Chance on the edge of the box now for Jamie Rother. Good strike, sorry all the way Kevin Atherton. Come to the edge of the box, Jamie Rother. He had one thing in his mind. As I say, Kevin Atherton had it well covered. Looking New Mills forward again. Jamie Rother coming deeper and deeper to get the ball. Here's Carlos Meekin. Ball out to the right hand side again for Daniel Grimshaw. He's been real live wise since he came on. Good strike, good save, and well held as well from Kevin Atherton. And again, it's Daniel Grimshaw on that right hand side. Cuts inside onto his left foot this time. Decent enough strike. Kevin Atherton down well. Was near post. Headed by Parker. Shea dice out. And back to Kevin Atherton. And the final whistle goes. And Tony Sullivan will be absolutely delighted with that performance from his Camel Lairds team. A hat trick from Sean Breen. Two from Craig Cairns. Camel Lairds 5. New Mills 0.